when we got into this thing that we were going to have to find our own way off the boat. I say we sink this tub all the way to the bottom as soon as we get Lulu back. If we got onto this boat, we may as well have rung the front doorbell. Everybody who's here will know that we are too, so be ready. But only use that as a last resort. Once you fire that, you're a target. Yeah, got it. You ready to face the dragon lady? Luke, I've never been more ready. No welcome party. Oh, there you are. Just playing games. Keeping us on our toes. But you enjoy games, don't you? <laughs> Here we are again. Seems like old times. Oh, please, make yourselves at home. This, this is your vessel, after all. Even if I am the one who gave it to you. Yeah, thanks. We're not staying. Oh, how tedious. God forbid we should skip a step. Now, I welcome you, you menace me, and then my guards make themselves known. Oh. And over your weapons. Oh, it would be a shame to mar this upholstery with your blood. Well, I think I can still get off a pretty lethal shot. How loyal do you think your boy toys are going to be when there's a bullet in your black heart? Either hand over your gun, Luke, or our game ends now. And Laura is the first to get shot. No, let me go! Let me go! Make up your mind, Luke. Your gun. Or her life. I certainly know which one I would choose. How disappointing. Now, where was I? Give me back my daughter, you bitch! Oh, how rude. But how typical. All those years and I still have no idea what my sons ever saw in you. May they rest in peace. I will get off on the subject of your evil spawn. Your mind is wandering, darling. It happens at a certain age. Don't test the limits of my affection for you. I'm in no mood for insults. I wouldn't hesitate to. To what? What are you gonna do, Helena? Are you gonna shoot us? Just like you had Nicholas shot? Nicholas has been shot? Well, she's really got that surprise thing down, doesn't she? You knew that Nicholas was gonna warn us that you were after Lulu. So you had to find a way to shut him up, didn't you? And thanks to you, he's now lying in a hospital bed, clinging to life. Why would I hurt my own grandson? My own flesh and blood. Oh, please. You'd eat your children for breakfast with an Uzo chaser. I saw you murder your own daughter in front of me. Oh, that deviant, I abhorred her. But Nicholas, I love him. I have no reason to hurt my grandson. Well, if you didn't have him shot, who did? Helena, tell us. If you're not the one who had Nicholas shot, then who is? I'm the one who asked the questions. Now, what proof do you have that my grandson was shot? You think we're lying to you? It's all over the news. What's the matter, you don't have satellite out here? <gasps> Luke! I assume that you have cell phones. Yeah, you have trouble with your international carrier? You want to borrow mine? I want to speak to Nicholas now. And I guarantee you the consequences will be severe. I can call Scotty. He promised me that he would stay at Nicholas's bedside. Keep it on speaker. No tricks. Okay. I just spoke to Leslie and your bodyguard slash babysitter and Spencer is okay, all right? He thinks that you're out of town, but he's fine, so. Ooh. Hello, Laura? Alexis, is that you? I I'm sorry, I was trying to reach Scotty. Uh, yeah, um, 
Oh, it's... This is Scott's phone. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to pick it up. It's just here. He went for a walk. Oh. Hey, is everything all right? Aren't you and Luke supposed to be chasing after Helena? Yes. Yes, we are. I was just calling to check in on Nicholas. How's he doing? Um, uh, he, he's okay. He had a little bit of a setback. What kind of a setback? Uh, look, Elizabeth said that he's on the road to recovery, so don't worry. Has he regained consciousness yet? Not yet. But the doctors really aren't concerned. So um, you shouldn't be either because I'm going to stay here and and tell he's out of the woods. See that you do, Natasha. Elena. The one and only. Luke and Laura captured you? On the contrary. It is I who did the capturing. What have you done with them? That is none of your concern. You only have to be worried about my grandson. Tell me, how is he? Do you think there's any chance that she's maybe telling the truth? Maybe she's not the one who had Nicholas shot? She lies like she breathes, but I don't think she had any idea. What does that mean? Nothing good. How does he look? Pale. But as handsome as ever. Is he in pain? No, because he's unconscious at the moment. But he's in stable condition, and the doctors say the prognosis is good. I am entrusting you with the care and well-being of Nicholas. Fail me, Natasha. And I will slit your throat just like I did that cow who dropped you. All right, Helena. You've got your proof. Now give me back my daughter. Let me be clear. You don't get to see anyone, not after what you did to Nicholas. What I did? It's your fault he was shot. It all comes back to you. Oh, this has nothing to do with Laura. One year, boys got a little trigger happy and plugged your grandson when he wasn't supposed to. We can't help it if you hire substandard peons. I assure you that my peons are quite efficient. Laura has been a source of unending pain for anyone who unfortunately would wander into her orbit, and that includes you, Luke. No, I'm doing everyone a favor. I will finally put an end to everyone's misery by finally putting an end to Laura. On the next General Hospital, you're just in time to toast my victory over you and Michael. Cheers. You and AJ have a complicated past. He's a selfish jerk. I love Kate, but I love Connie too. I will finally put an end to Laura.